So I want to talk about how to deal with um, dried and matte areas on your paint. If you've painted a painting like I have this painting and it's about halfway done, and as this paint has dried, it's become sunken in and matte, and I can no longer see what the true color is. Here, this is supposed to be black, but it looks like gray because it's become so flat. So I really want this paint to look like it looked when it was wet, and so I can look into it and really see what my colors are. And so I could varnish the painting, but varnishing a painting halfway is, is a big no-no as far as conservation goes because you don't want to put varnish between multiple layers of paint. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to oil out this surface here, and I want to show you how to do that. It's very simple. I start with a, this is just a t-shirt material, 100% cotton, soft cloth that doesn't have any soap or anything in it. Very dr and, and it's dry, it's not wet. And I put just a little bit of refined linseed oil into the cloth. And I can just barely dip it and then squeeze it. And I'm, my objective is to put as little oil into this cloth as I need to. I don't want it to be dripping wet. I don't want it to be soaked with oil. I want it to have just a little bit of oil. We don't want to put a big oily coat all over this dry paint. We want to just barely coat it with just, a, just enough oil to do the job and no more. So if you look at this area here, that's nice. See how it's gotten all flat. And if I take this cloth and I start to rub, see how it brought back all of that old color? And so when I go to repaint these roses, I want to know what it's going to look like when it's varnished or when it's like wet paint. And so this brings it all back, just like varnish would. But I don't want it to be thick. And this may become flat again. So that's why I'm going to do this oiling out right before I'm ready to paint. So that's about it, and I want to, if you've, if you've put too much oil down and you feel like it's, um, maybe you've overdone it, you can go back with a dry cloth and rub it on top and pick up some of that oil, because you don't want to put a big heavy coat. But that's about it, and that's really helpful um, if your painting is starting to dry and get real matte.